the holidays are almost over. You suddenly realize that you are not ready for the coming months. And when I mean you are not ready, you do not have a PC already set up for the work that you have to do in September, in October, in November, and December. Or let's take a look at it from this perspective. Your son is going back to school just next month, comes to you and says, Dad, I do need a PC for my math class. I do need a PC for my physics class. And you suddenly realize, wait a minute, I do not really have a PC set up for him. And you have absolutely no idea how time flies. And now you're a little bit worried, a little bit confused. Read not know what to do, but you know you are sure of two things. First, you don't want to spend a lot of money on a PC. Secondly, you want a PC that is actually very solid. Doesn't matter if it's going to be for you or it's going to be for your son. You want a PC that can absolutely handle any task that you throw at it. But the problem is, you really don't know which PC fits these two combinations, which is you will not have to spend a lot of money. And the PC has to come equipped with all the things that you need to have a memorable working experience. This is the Fujitsu Esprimo D7010. Probably not have heard of it. I have heard of this PC. I've used it myself. It's a PC that I can tell you for free has everything that you are possibly looking for right now. This PC is one solidly built PC, has a 10th gen Intel Core i5 processor, which means you'll be working with something that is relatively recent. You won't have to deal with all these lags that come with slow processors. This is one processor that has been tested. It has been tested on graphic editing programs like Photoshop. It has been tested on video editing programs like Premiere Pro. In fact, if it could work on Premiere Pro and Photoshop, then your office package pretty much just be a walkover. This is one PC that I can highly recommend to you. Let's say you're in the market right now. You really don't know exactly what to go for. I can highly recommend that you do go ahead and check out this PC. This PC comes equipped with a lot of ports. You have the USB 3.1 port. You have the USB-C port, which if this is your main consideration because I kind of get it, it's 2024. Nobody wants to use a PC that's only limited to USB 3.0 port. This PC has got a USB-C port, like I said, enabling you to connect your USB-C devices. Even though the PC looks so small, it's a small form factor PC, it still has a DVD drive right in front of it. Just in case, you still want to use DVD drive to install some of your programs. At the back of this PC, we've got two display ports right there. This is just enough for you to connect two monitors, three monitors, up to four monitors. And if you still think that's not enough, you've got a possibility to slap in a graphic card on this PC, which makes it possible for you to even connect more monitors depending on the kind of work that you do. But I personally tend to work with just two monitors. And given that this PC comes with an Intel UHD graphic 630, this is exactly just enough for me. I've actually worked on two full HD monitors with this PC and had absolutely no problems whatsoever. This PC comes with an 8GB of DDR4 RAM, but let's say this is not enough for you. You have the possibility to upgrade it. And on this channel, I've actually showed you how to upgrade quite a wide range of PCs. So you could upgrade it up to 32 gigabytes, and if you still feel that's not enough, you could still go ahead to push the limit just like you find necessary. On this PC, you have the possibility to actually get an NVMe SSD installed, and NVMe SSD right now is actually the directions to go. Gone are the days where you just upgrade your PC with a SATA SSD. You won't be getting the best in terms of speed. So the best thing that you want to do is to have a PC that gives you the possibility to install an NVMe SSD. You might be thinking now, hardware money, given that this PC has gotten all these beautiful features, wouldn't it be very, very expensive? Believe me, this PC is pretty much affordable. If you go on to hardwaremoney.de, you can actually get this PC for very affordable prices. Decent, when I mean decent, I mean PCs in very, very good condition, not just optical condition, but technical condition as well. Feel free to check out the PCs we've got on hardwaremoney.de. We've got decent computers ranging from Lenovo PCs, Dell PCs, Fujitsu PCs, Hip PCs, and the list goes on and on and on. If you take a look at this PC, even though it's a small form factor PC, it has been so cutely built. In front of it, it's got a typical Fujitsu red line. Now, it became a little bit smaller when you compare it to what you have in the previous models. When I mean previous models, I mean the Fujitsu Esprimo D757 or the D756. Pretty much the original designs of the Fujitsu Esprimo small form factor PCs have been kept, except for just some little difference that is not so noticeable in front of the PC. The PC looks a little bit smaller when you compare it to the D757. Looking very cute, solid design, well engineered and I believe that this PC is one PC that you want to consider getting. Beautiful thing is that this PC, believe me when I tell you that this PC is extremely very quiet. If you put on this PC, you pretty much not hear 
this PC fan spinning, which is one thing that consider I myself, I do hate PCs that make a lot of noise. And this is one thing I do like about the Fuji 2S Primo PCs. I've taken a look at a lot of PCs, but I find the Fuji 2S Primo PCs to be very, very quiet. You do not hear any noise even when the PC is in full operation. Kind of amazing how these things have been engineered. If you have a small apartment, this is exactly what you need. If you have a partner that really hates you walking at night, this is what you want to have. Because if you have this kind of PC, he or she does not know whenever you are walking, he or she doesn't hear anything, and you do not need to make any form of unnecessary apologies because your PC just would not want to walk like a normal PC, only making this kind of heavy noises. So do yourself a lot of good. Get something like this. The holiday is going to be over very soon. Do not wait to the last minute because good offers like this, they tend to sell out very, very fast. I've used this PC on a number of programs. I've never ever had any problems with it. I can highly recommend it to you. Let's say you are right now looking for something decent. The Fujitsu Esprimo D7010 is one PC that you will find very, very interesting. And I've not had any regrets in using it. And I believe that if you go ahead to buy it, you are possibly going to have the same experience that I have, which is experience satisfaction. You're going to experience reliability and ultimately you're going to be having a PC that will handle all your tasks effortlessly. I hope this video helps you to make a purchase decision. If it does, do go ahead and click on the like button, subscribe to the channel. Until I see you again, peace.